What's happening guys? Welcome back to my reaction to Demon Slayer. We're up to episode 9. Uh, Temari, Demon and Arrow Demon. So I'm assuming that's the name of these two attacking. Um, so last time, uh, pretty much, uh, ah, I hate it when I can't think. Tanjiro has uh, found a demon that can actually help him. Like they've got, she's got a uh, she's made a deal with him, so if uh, he allows her to um, take a look at uh, Nezuko, and maybe even look at her blood, um, she will help him turn Nezuko back to being full human. Um, but it also involves uh, getting, like, blood from other demons, so luckily... We've got these uh, two demons again, this uh, maybe Tamurai demon and Arrow demon uh, that are going, that's started to attack them. I think her name is, Ka I'm probably going to mess this one up, but uh, Kano, Kano, something like that. Uh, I think that's the right uh, woman this time. But one thing I've been trying to start doing and I've completely failed recently in doing is actually responding to a few comments before I begin. So, uh, let's see. I'm starting with uh, episode 7. Uh, Swamp Demon, uh, Mean with Nezuko. Whoever wrote, sorry, but whoever wrote this, I mean, I'm just, maybe your English is not your first language, but that's okay. Uh, the Swamp Demon, uh, Mean with Nezuko, get a lot of blood from him, Muzan. He was too scared to think his name. May, it's possible. Uh, then we've got, I remember the first time I watched this episode, I thought it was way too early to be meeting the big antagonist. I know, right? It's like the seventh episode in and we're meeting uh, <laughs> uh, the big bad this time, uh, well, like straight away, um, which may turn out, maybe he's not actually the big bad of the, of the show. Um, some people, I think the other affectionate name people call him is like Michael Jackson, apparently. Um, it's because, you know, he looks like Michael Jackson. I think a lot of people, I think when it first aired, uh, they, they like, that's what he looks like. Why am I blanking on his actual name at the moment? Uh, where is he? So many characters in Demon Slayer that it's a bit difficult to keep up with all their names. Where is he? Where is he? No, 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 no. Where is he? All right. I miss him somehow. Nope. Nope. Crap, where is he? Oh, no. oh that, that's the horn demon from last time. Oh, freaking damn it. I can't find the guy. <laughs> but anyway. All right, there he is. Muzan. Yeah, Muzan. A lot of people say he looks like Michael Jackson for some reason. I can kind of see it, actually. But yeah, um, yeah, wait, it feels like it's way too early to meet him. <laughs> like, eight, like, seven or six episodes in. Uh, sorry, seven episodes in, like, yeah, here's, here's the villain, that sort of thing. Um, and then, of course, the bigger issue at hand isn't whether or not uh, Tanjiro should attack him in the open uh, like this or not. It's more the matter of if, if even he could, yeah. Lots of people about, um, but, you know, Tanjiro is actually not that, well, powerful yet. He's only recently become a Demon Slayer. So, going up against uh, Mu uh, Mujin, I messed that name up, apologies, um, Michael Jackson. I'm just going to call him Michael Jackson, seriously. It's easier. <laughs> um, yeah, Michael Jackson's on another level to, uh, to Tanjiro. So... In fact, he can see that this guy can just like scratch somebody and turn them into a demon. Yeah. Uh, yeah, top of the food, ch food chain, definitely. The strongest demon in existence. Do you really think a new recruit like Tanjiro would even be able to last 30 seconds? No, not even 30 seconds. It'd be like 10 seconds against him at this point. But uh, that's all the comments for episode uh, seven. Let's do episode eight. Demon Slayer. Slayer. Um, eight. 
What did you guys leave me for that one? Oh, just the one. Okay. Um, yeah, so Dimgo at the end is not Shinobu. Yeah, because I mis mistook her for Shinobu, uh, who will meet later. I'm pretty sure we did meet her in the um, in the train in the seven day training uh, uh, ground. Like she was one of the uh, last ones standing. But anyway, next episode is is the two demons say each other's name. Maybe you pick it up. Well, now that you've given told me that, I probably will pick it up. But yeah. Let us now jump into episode 9 of Demon Slayer and see how they fight these demons in 3, 2, 1. We're pretty much leaving, uh, starting off exactly where we left off. I'm just changing the, or, um, yeah. That's a, those balls are very, no, not balls because, are they balls that got like a bell in them? Here we go. Now the question is, did Mutant tell these two about Tanjiro. Like at the very least, hey, um, he's just like, seems to be like a demon slayer. Just be on your guard a little bit. Mind you, I guess maybe he'll just, Mushin's just like, eh, he's not going to be much of a threat. He's, it's possible that he will underestimate uh, Tanjiro. At first, I can actually kind of see that happening, actually. MJ totally um, underestimating Tanjiro well, um, and then realizing he, Tanjiro is more of a threat later on. And I'm honestly actually kind of expecting uh, this OP to change later on. Like, I know it's 20, not meaning that it's because it's 25 episodes, there's going to be like two OPs. I mean, like, it will change after a certain point. If that, because uh, some anime do that. Well, they just blew up, well, not blew up, but they definitely damaged the, um, the house. Y Yaba. So they knew there was a hidden building. Okay, so they have not been informed. You don't like dust? Don't like your, your robes getting dirty? Then move back. If you're so worried about your kimono getting dirty, just move back away from her a little bit. So, so, so that those ball things are called a tamari. Okay. Well, yes. Yes, she is.
There's only so long you guys can p sit there. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh yeah, the ladies. There's still that lady there, yeah. Yeah, this is going to be on a totally different level. Yeah, yes, they are. Will be fine. So saying it in the plural. I guess he can be resurrected. What happens if you slice that thing? The Tamari. What if you slice it? What will happen? Does it have any uh, strings? That's not going to do much. Yeah. Okay. See, maybe she can control it. Also, where did his head go? Ah, so he can reform. Okay. I was right. Hmm. Seems so. <laughs> I didn't, yeah, I thought as much. He's not, he wouldn't have died that easily. Hey, at least you're having fun. <laughs> Twelve demon moons. Okay, so there's 12 of them. Makes sense. Oh. More arms. Okay. Make, okay. Let's see, you can only... Oh. Never mind, I was going to say there was still only two of those, but... Nope. <laughs> Oof. Need some to switch to attack mode. Yeah, there's only much Tanjiro can do.
So it doesn't matter how many he hit, he sh slices. They're always going to be a problem. Yeah, as we saw, like, his entire head came back. Ah, oh, okay. Oh, good. Because, yeah, it makes sense. There's two demons and they're working together. One does have arrows on his hands. Yeah, it's... All right, so she, he... It was just her, okay. Take care of the one in the tree. So the... The the male one. All right. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Good luck with that. Oh, this is good. Oh, this animation though. So. Oh. Okay, so I was right, it was him. I knew, I had a feeling that they were working together. No! There goes her arms. Most likely, yes. That's the plan. That's the plan to get the blood from them. Meanwhile. Okay, flashback. Yes. Yeah, I remember that. That's what I said at the beginning. Like these two. It won't be easy. But right, if anyone can do it, I'm pretty sure was, I'm pretty sure Tanjiro can. Yep, there goes her arms. Well, there, go, there goes that blood. Yeah, this is how he's going to get stronger. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Meanwhile, back with Ezeko and Arrows. <laughs> <laughs> he really doesn't like his dust. Yeah, it's not going to be an uh, easy fight for Nezuko either. Yep, 
Regrow the arms. Yeah, you can't let her... You can't stop attacking even for a second. And she's got those again. Oh. All right, swap. Uh, swap who they're going after. So, okay, we're going to get see these two fight. I'm very curious to see how these two are going to fight. Uh, yeah. Two, essentially two humans that she needs to protect. <laughs> His neck. Uh, yeah, he can cut the thread. Yeah, it's not going to be easy. You have to... I guess to, he's just going to have to find a way to dodge those arrows. But he has to get out of it first. Nice! I love the animation on that on these attacks. These moves, they're so well and so greatly animated. Nezuko can easily block all that. Oh, I mean, sorry, dodge. Wow. So he can go invisible. Is that, is that, is this really the time? A fugitive? Oh. Sometimes it's better to not say anything. He's gonna kick it. Oh. Oh shit. So he's lost her leg. Ooh. Oh. Well, she is. You are a doctor. You need a plan, Tanjiro. You need. Don't panic. Whatever you do, Tanjiro, just don't panic. Maybe don't keep. Hmm. Maybe don't always rely on the thread. Think of new ways to attack, maybe? Yeah, yeah, they really are. I agree with that.
Mm. So I guess the only option he has is to dodge them and get closer. Somehow get closer to him. Ooh. Oh, no. Okay. All right, spin in the same direction as the arrow. Just like, yeah, that time. That's how you do it, Tanjiro. <laughs> this is how you do it. You, just don't let go. Of the sword. Nice! There he goes. Remember to get the blood though. That's how you do it. But yeah, seriously, Tanjiro, don't forget the blood. <laughs> you need the blood. But damn, Nezuko lost her arm, uh, uh, sorry, arm, her leg. <laughs> Shit. How? Hmm. Well, I guess she is a demon, so I guess it can be reattached. Just the healing, pro uh, yeah, the healing process is a lot slower than usual. But yeah, one down, one to go. <laughs> well, out of these two anyway, there's like another, what was it, like 13 out of the 14 of the, so, mind you, I'm probably getting the numbers mis mixed up. Oh, okay, so the first time they've actually met. All right. Awesome episode. Some really great uh, fight pro uh, chronog 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 Some really great fighting this episode. <laughs> um, uh, lovely animation again. I I just love the like uh like the blade water. I guess you could, I'm going to call it that. The blade water is so amazing to look at i just love that so much it's oh so good and yeah that using the uh 
to go in the opposite direction of the arrow so you get so Tanjiro can get out of it. That is also re a really smart move. Uh, yeah, adapt pretty much. That's the best strategy to really have is to adapt to your opponent uh, so that you can take them down. Oh, wow. So good. Hope you enjoyed my reaction to this episode. You can find a link to my latest video here. A link to my YouTube channel will be here. You can find links to my Discord, anime list, Twitter, etc. in the description below. Feel free to check those out. And I'll see you in the next one, guys. Have a good day as always. Bye.